what is red, white, and blue for you? Uh, patriotic, uh, you know, of course, the American flag, and I go, and that's not what I'm thinking, and I go, why don't you think outside of the box, you know? Think of red, white, and blue in your eyes, in your life, in your perspective, you know? How would you portray that? I want to show that people live comfortably, knowing the fact that they're poor, that they have opportunities, and they're trying to use the best that they can to live good. To pretty much show people in my own eyes uh, what I see every day, what people don't get to see. So we're gonna walk up here, but I'm trying to see where I can go. And this is the area where I tell you all these people are you know, clandestine shops <laughs> and food and stuff like that. They're all up on this street right here. Yeah, I remember coming down here as a kid with my mom and we did a lot of shopping here because you know, things were cheap. You know, you can buy socks, underwear, shoes, like passport and all that. My trusty old Nikon FT2 that is blacked out. Sign of a true photographer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I love it. I don't think we're going to see past 10 frames. <laughs> they remind me of my family too, so I love that. I took a picture of them behind them, but I told her, hey, let me take a picture of you. And they didn't want that. And I, I kind of want to, but you know what? I want to pull some money out and buy some money. If I buy some money, can I take your picture? but see they were so inviting about it and they were cool she was like oh you're filming me but if you're gonna film me, let everybody know that I'm selling tamales, and and, and I thought that was funny, you know. Uh, actually, I'm on frame eight right now, so I don't want to be redundant and show more of what's this. I'd rather just go somewhere else. You know what I mean? Do you want to eat this? Fuck yeah. <laughs> All right, being honest, I didn't know like where to go or what to do. But one of the spots is that first spot that we hit up. Because I remember those people and they reminded me so much of where I come from. Actually, I was born in East LA. I moved to Orange County because I didn't want my daughter to grow up with this thing. That's why. Because I know what happens. I know what... When you get lost in the, in the City of Angels, you get lost. That's like a small fine print that wasn't disclosed when you came to this country. Oh, by the way, you can get lost and you end up homeless, you know, or drugs and this and that. They paint a great picture of American dream. And, but what is the American dream? Some people say, well, it's a land of opportunity. You're like, really? For who? Because there's a bunch of people in this country, in all major cities, that haven't got the opportunity for the American dream. It's a little trippy, so for me, this is food. 
There you go. Boom. <laughs> like boom. <laughs> there you go. Happiness right there. The lady made it. <laughs>